A dog is recovering tonight after being attacked by a pit bull, and now officials hope the dog's owner comes forward to claim it. Our Karina son joins us with this story. Karina. Patty, Mark Berger and his dog were on their daily walk when they were attacked. Now left with more than $1,000 in medical bills, Berger hopes the pit bull's owner comes forward. And this is Reggie Wayne Miller time. Um... I know, funny name. But the eight-year-old black lab went through a very serious ordeal. So he's got uh, multiple, multiple puncture wounds to the chest, got an artery severed. was pretty much from here all the way up to here. The attack required surgery. Come here. And although Reggie will recover, to what degree is still uncertain. Of course I was freaked out that my dog is sitting there just being mauled to death. Mark Berger says he was taking his dog out for a walk just a few minutes from home when the pair rounded this corner Monday evening. You get right about here and then all of a sudden, wham, that dog just comes running straight across the street, locks under Reggie and starts, you know, dragging in that direction. Berger says his pit bull mauled Reggie for what seemed like a few minutes while another stray dog stood by. Both were taken to Maricopa County Animal Care and Control, but the dog's owner has not come forward. Berger hopes that happens soon. They clearly were out on the loose. They weren't restrained. They weren't chained. No, they had no tags. You know, it's just there's a whole series of things that they've done that are irresponsible as an owner. Okay. And the pit bull has to be quarantined for 10 days, and then it will likely be euthanized, although there is still a small chance it would be allowed to live if an owner comes forward. Tempe police say it's unknown at this time what charges the dog's owner could face. Karina Sun, 3TV. Good evening, Arizona. I'm Patty Kirkpatrick. A valley man and his dog are recovering from serious wounds tonight after the two were attacked by a pit bull while on a walk. As Karina Sun reports, so far no one is claiming responsibility for that pit bull. That's right, Patty. The dog is locked away, but it's the owners who are still on the loose. And one Tempe man is hoping they come forward. Reggie, come. Come see Daddy. Reggie is moving around pretty well after a pit bull attacked him two days ago. The eight-year-old black lab suffered multiple puncture wounds and under the bandages. You got an artery severed was pretty much from here all the way up to here. Reggie's owner, Mark Berger, also suffered a wound that required several stitches. <coughs> this is a pit bull accused of the violent attack. Subdued now, but workers at Maricopa County Animal Care and Control say he's dangerous. Of course I'm freaked out that my dog is sitting there just being mauled to death. The attack happened on Monday night when Berger says he was taking Reggie out for a walk just a few minutes from home. The pair rounded this corner. Full on sprint. <laughs> Just lock it right on his chest area, and that's when he, you know, made the puncture wounds. Berger says the fight lasted a few minutes. The pit bull and another stray that stood nearby were taken to the pound. And more than $1,000 in medical bills later... I just hope whoever owns the dogs, you know, comes, comes forward and claims some responsibility for him. After a surgery for his artery, Reggie is now expected to recover. But to what degree is still uncertain. Berger... There you go. Good boy. ...is just glad his best friend is still alive. And the pit bull has to be quarantined for 10 days, and then it will likely be euthanized. Although, there is still a small chance it will be allowed to live if an owner does come forward. Karina Sun, 3TV.